developed. So whatever is already on there, just get rid of it and then treat the new one. And you'll start to see it will come less than it ever has been before. So from the first day you start using No-No, I mean, that's the last time you're ever going to have that much hair. So if you're shaving, that's not the case. You're still going to have the same amount tomorrow and the next day and the next day. And for some of us that are using it on their faces, I came over here because I wanted to show you LaDawn's before and after. That's a big, big difference because maybe right now you're doing nothing. You're not even shaving your face. You're not waxing. You're not doing anything. Take a look at her before and after. This is a big difference because for those of you that have maybe the, you know, the sideburns or the thick, dense hair. There you go. She had look at your a, skin. Lot, a lot of stubble. And you did, how long did that take you to get that off? About six weeks. <clears throat> it took me about six weeks every day, a couple of times a day, because I do have such thick, coarse, like ethnic curly hair. Mm -hmm. So it took a lot of determination. First, I lightly cut it. Of course, never shave your face. But right. I cut it, and then I went over it a couple of times during the day, and it made such a huge difference. That's why I have my hair up today, because I feel more comfortable and confident in myself. And you look amazing. Your skin looks amazing. I mean, that's the big thing. I think it changes the way people, I mean, Marina, that was a big thing for you too, was the way your skin looks. Because you had told me too, it's, you had been shaving, waxing, doing stuff for a long, long time. And now you can see just in a matter of six weeks, what a difference that will make, both, on, both girls. So if you're talking about your face and you're doing something on your face, you don't want to shave. You don't want to wax. You no. don't want to rip and pull. You do and not do want to take scissors. No, to your face. you don't want to take scissors. Sorry, Ladonna, to your face. I did the same thing. No, I, I did know. the same thing. I want to quickly show Marina too before we we talk to the caller because when we talk about your skin and how it's glowy and shiny, and we don't have it before in her, but you'll be able to hear in her voice that she tells you mm -hmm. she's just so excited the difference this is made for her. But you have a whole family that was waxing. That's right, um, Jen. We all waxed, and it was just costing so much money. And for me. Um, my skin is sensitive and, and more mature, so um, if I had my skin wax, the hair waxed off, my skin would go really red. Everyone would know that, that oh, she waxed her moustache. We know what yeah. she did. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 They don't call it peach buzz, no. do they? It's a moustache, right? <laughs> And it wasn't pretty. Uh -huh. <laughs> so um, that's why I, I got the no-no to start with, was for the peach fuzz, and uh, especially on my moustache, and it was a lot darker there. You're laughing at my accent. It sounds so, you just sound so sophisticated. It sounds better yeah. when you say it than right. when we say it. I said, moustache. Like, beard. it's more syllables. A moustache. She makes that one sound pretty. I know, doesn't she? It's like, well, moustache. It's just a moustache. It's just a moustache. And a moustache. Right. Right. <laughs> sounds way better when you say it. <laughs> uh, and the best part about that is, I'll show you again, if we show the price chart, how much money I just saved her. She pretty much uh, owes me is really I what do. it's all about. I owe you big time, Because Jane. we sat and added up one day. <clears throat> you know, it's $77. Remember, this is one leg, okay? So $150 for one person in her family to get waxed. She has three of them. So $450 later, a month for, you know, her wonderful daughters and herself, that's how much she was spending on an ongoing basis. That's crazy. But we do it as women. We're like, oh, yeah, whatever it takes, we're willing to invest in it. So she didn't have to do that. Now she owns a no-no. She's done making monthly payments. All the girls can share it in her family, and they have it for the rest of their lives. So, yes, Tina, our last caller, bought a spare because people were using hers. They can just share one. You only need one in the household. Everybody can use it. The husband, the wives, that's probably why our black is most limited. You got a lot of men. You got a lot of high mm -hmm. school boys. Anyone who's using that. You only need one. So not only did I just save her, what we added up, I think it was like $32,000 that <laughs> I'll just, you can go ahead and, and buy my next dinner, but <laughs> she's done. That's the great part. I saved her the money and she's done for good. Like that's a huge, huge statement to make when you think about the investment that we all make in beauty products in general. You know, other than we talked about the tips, there's no auto ship. You don't have to continue to buy this like our makeup or our skincare. There isn't this ongoing maintenance as you have to do with laser treatments. One device, one time. How many flex pays? Five flex pays. That's Five it. flex payments, $44. In the black, we have 70 left. In the silver, we have 80 left. In Ooh, the gold, those with men the leopard, are really out there today. 260 of them left. And then we have just a little <laughs> bit more than that in the snow leopard, which is our silver one with the snow leopard print. We're going to welcome in Carla from Indiana. Carla, thank you very much for joining us today. Which color did you pick up today? 
the gold. You got the gold. Isn't nice. that pretty? I love the gold. Oh, it's beautiful. Now, um, I do have a quick question. This is my first time utilizing this, and I am so excited. Um, I have really dry skin, especially on my legs. It, it, it's okay to utilize the no-no on, uh, on that, correct? Absolutely. I have very dry skin, too. Before we got here, I'm like, is there any no-no smooth around? Because I am losing it. <laughs> I mean, I just left negative six degrees yesterday to come here. And everyone's like, it's cold. I'm like, it's 55. This is joyous. So, yes, oh. of course you can use it. My recommendation, okay. too, is when All you're right. buffing. Uh, I, can men use this on their face for their, for their beards, or is this just for the women? No, I mean, men can use it, sure. I don't, a lot of men ask if they can use it on their bald heads, which I don't necessarily suggest. But yes, you can use this, <laughs> men, women, anywhere, you can use this on the face all over. It might take a little bit longer if he has coarse, thick hair, but you uh -huh. can absolutely use it. Oh, what's wonderful. That I'm so excited about this. I'm so sick of using chemicals on your face to remove the, the hair on your face. Yes. And you get it too close to your mouth, and you're panicking because you don't want that in your mouth. And right. So I'm really excited about this. Oh, I'm so excited for you. You're going to love it. And definitely get, if we have, I don't know if we have it online, but if we can check. If there's some no-no smooth, that's the lotion that I use, too. It's a larger one. It has, you know, incredible moisturizing ingredients, and it really, really helps to keep them. I was sitting here with the serum we have, like, rubbing it on me. Yeah, it it actually so helps dry. to retard the growth yes. even more, so it just makes it even easier. But, yeah, you can still use your regular lotions. But Anything. you'll also find, too, when you buff it off, mm -hmm. it actually helps buff off more of that dead skin cell, that, sort of that surface surface layer, yep. and then you put your lotion on, you'll be amazed okay. how much that lotion just drinks into your skin. It's really nice. Because there's just, no hair. Because there's no hair. It, right. It's not just holding it on top of the surface. It's actually getting into the skin. So instead of just being on top of that hair, it really is great. Carla, thank you very much for your call. I'm and excited. best of luck. Great questions, too. Well, thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, we're going to continue on. We want to remind you, if you're just now tuning in, what is NoNo? NoNo is a product that is used for long-term hair removal with continued use. I say with continued use because you want to use this. You're doing something right now probably every single day. If you're shaving your legs, you're probably doing it every day. If you are shaving your face, I'm going to ask you to put down the razor. What happens? We think of men. They have that coarse, dark hair, right? Every time you shave, it comes back a little thicker, a little heavier, and then it's that stubble. This is the difference. Your hair does not come back coarser. It doesn't come back thicker. This is not a blade. It is a Thermacon tip, and that Thermacon tip actually treats the hair at the surface. People also ask, can you shave first? I had done that before because there were times where I was doing my no-no, and then all of a sudden I looked and... Kind of time was of the essence and I had to get going. So then I could go in and I could also finish up and I could shave. You can, you also don't have to wait for that hair to grow out and be nice and long. Like you have to with a waxing, the hair has to be at, I think it's like an eighth of an mm -hmm. inch in the length before they can actually wax it because it has to be something they're attached to. You don't have to worry about that either. You can go right over that. And that's what Jen taught me. She said, don't do it twice a week. She goes, just do it every day. And it kind of becomes part of the routine. And you just do that. You're watching TV or you're playing your games online or whatever you're doing. And you just sort of do this and then you don't think about it. And then all of a sudden you go on vacation and you're like, I don't even have to take a uh, razor with me. I don't have to worry about this. I don't have to think, oh gosh, I can't go right. to the beach because I shaved my legs this morning. Right. There's no pain to this. It's simple. It's easy to do. You also do it in the privacy of your own home. And you can do when, like for me, I started off and I wanted my legs. Well, I can tell you at this age, now I would be going in and I would be getting treatments done on my face. Because I had the no-no, I was able to do the treatments on my face and do them right at home. The black, we have 30 left. The silver, we have 45 left. The gold, we have 200 left. That is it. If you it's do the want those color the choices, out there, I'm telling you. they're going to go really, really fast. You know, it's funny you say that, Kathy, because like I said, when I started here, it was almost eight years ago. So the original unit, you can only be used for the neck down and you had to plug it in. The technology was great and people were loving it. And the big thing everyone said is, can we use this on your face? Well, here's me. I'm like, why do people want this for their face? Mm -hmm. I mean, I... Because it wasn't I was concerned only 25, at the time, right? knows, And I'm like, I don't really, I think I need to worry about anything like that. Well, here we are eight years later and everybody loves this for the face. And I'm like, where is that no-no? Right. <laughs> I am really getting old over here. But the nice part is, if you have a no-no from a couple years ago and now you're kind of done using it on a regular basis, and the men or whoever are using it and you want a new one or you want to upgrade to the fun leopard print 
this technology is always going to be here. The te we, we didn't do anything other than little tiny tweaks to make the unit better or to make it, you know, different and fun. This technology is brought to us by a company called Radiancy. And they're the leaders in light and, light and heat based technology. They have big devices in their offices in New York, wherever it is, and it's very expensive to go in and have one treatment. What they've done is they've patented that technology in a little unit that you and I can have at home so that we can have that same treatment, that same type of technology in the privacy, like, like Kathy said, of our own home. We don't have to make appointments. We don't have to be embarrassed, like she said, and strip down in front of somebody and say, yes, please, let me just write, let me pay you the $150 and just rip off the hair off my body and be embarrassed and leave looking like I had it done. No, with this, you're gonna look better. The minute you know, no, you look better after having done it. Any one of us ladies, men, whoever, will say that, especially for the face, because your skin glows. It gives you that youthful look because you don't have a layer of peach fuzz sitting on it. So I'll show you quickly here, like Cindy, see? A layer of peach fuzz around it looks almost like she has a halo effect. Mm -hmm. It's gone, her skin looks smoother, it looks clearer, and her jawline looks more defined. The thing with her, too, was because she has so much, you're not going to take your tweezers and sit there and pluck out every last hair right. like you would, for example, if you have a mustache or whatever. Mm -hmm. It sounds better <laughs> when she says it, or a beard. If you have those stubborn hairs that you're tweezing, it's going to treat those. If you have a whole face of peach fuzz, it's going to treat those. This is going to do wherever, whenever. It just might take a little bit longer in certain areas. I'll show you how to use it real quick because like Kathy said, her mom calls and says, you guys make it look so easy. It is very easy, but you do need to you know, stick with it. This front panel here, this tells you what level you're on. So for example, if you wanna start on a lower level just cause you're not used to it, maybe you, know, you are scared or whatever, go ahead. I mean, you'll realize quickly it doesn't feel like anything. Then you move it on up depending on if you're doing that coarse, thick, dark hair. Right here is the tip. Those just pop in and out. It's just a tiny wire, so no fear that there is a blade or anything's gonna hurt you. It's nothing. I mean, you, you just kind of start going. And like she said, we call it the no-no glide. That's because we're treating the hair that hasn't yet come in yet. So if you have surface hair on there, like I said earlier, go ahead and shave it off, do whatever you were doing, get rid of it. You do not need to sit there and try and no-no every little hair. It would take you a long time because there is no blade. That's why we are treating the hair that hasn't yet come in. So when you see this animation, just as I am going over my skin, so is the no-no there, it's going into the hairs that haven't yet come. That's why with continued use, our hair grows in random cycles. You don't know, you know, every 24, whatever it is, 36 hours. You don't know which hairs are growing today versus tomorrow. That's why if you've potentially gone and had a laser treatment, maybe it didn't work, maybe you saw got some of it but not all of it, that's because you only went one or two times, whatever it was, you didn't have the opportunity to get all the hairs. Oh, the black's gone. Black is gone, sorry. But the leopard silver print, will be gone in the a second. The leopard prints are still here. That's and what's most important. And by the way, important. if you like the silver, here's where the leopard print is, the snow leopard. It is silver with just a touch of the leopard. So yeah. it's the snow leopard and the black around the side and then at the bottom and when you're using the no, no yeah, I was gonna say hold on to the oh, top. Yep. That's it. So it's still it's still masculine, man. Right. Come on, you're all good. That's and at right. the end of the day, you're doing this in the privacy of your own home. So really it doesn't matter if it's pink or purple or leopard or whatever. You're treating your hair and that's they what all you work are. the same. Yes. <laughs> and I know that if you for some of the guys that have tried their wives or whatever, they don't care. They're just like, just get me whatever. Give me whatever's cheapest or on flex pay. That's what you know, if yes. it was up to Andy, that's yeah. what he would say. <laughs> I don't care if it's green, you know, just whatever is the cheapest. But it, it's gonna work. And when we started the presentation, we showed you the faces of no no. And I think that's such a powerful thing because for those that are calling, the men, the people that called in earlier with gray hair, thick hair, dark, will it work for everybody? And the answer is yes. So in Kathy's case, she was told she couldn't use it. She couldn't get laser because she had light hair, dark skin. Can she no-no? Yes. Do you have gray hair and can you no-no? Yes. You're like my cousin over here, Bobby, thick, dark, dense hair. Can you no-no? Yes. You have fair skin, but very dark hair and dark features. Can you no-no? Yes. I think that's probably why it was called the no-no. <laughs> yes, you could do it. Could be called yes, yes. Yes, no. <laughs> yes. The nice thing is it's the faces of everybody because there's not many beauty products and not many beauty technology products 
that no one is exempt from. This is something that you could gift to anyone and they will love it because they can use it. And everybody worries about hair. I mean, there's no, I can't think of anybody that's like, eh, I'm just gonna let it grow. I look good with, you know, I never worried about the hair on my hair. arms until I, I had no hair anywhere else and that's like, well, why wouldn't I have why this would you completely just leave that, smooth? You know? Why am I worrying about that? And I said, there's going to be nothing left to no no. What about here? So I started only doing my left arm. So I came today and I was hunting. And I'm like, <laughs> all right, there's one right there. And I would go over that <coughs> one hair. We just lost the silver. The black is already sold out. We're going to welcome in Shirley, who's calling us, I believe, from Tennessee. That's right. Correct. Hi, Good Shirley. morning. Great Hi. to have you with us. Thank you. I'm, I'm enjoying watching the show again because I'm picking up on things that I missed that I was going to suggest you put on the CD for a visual oh. for us older ladies. Um, I am 67, going to be 68, and I have uh, gray hair by my ear that was going in my ear and tickling me, so I cut it off short and I no not it off. And I got to tell you, I was up in Pittsburgh for a few months and I came back home and I went to see my lady that does my hair at the beauty shop. She said, what have you done to your face? You've, you look different. You've changed. I, she said, do you want me to wax your lip? And I said, nope, just my eyebrows. And she goes, your face looks different. It looks really radiant. It looks great. I said, well, Linda, I've been using the no-no. She said, I've been wanting one. So I called her up already, <laughs> tell her to order one. <laughs> Love and that. She wanted to get one, but I told her, wait, let me try it first. I still have some hair. I'm not probably on it every day like I should be, but I have one quick question for you. Yeah. What is the young lady on the left using? It looks like some kind of lotion, and is she using it before she shaves or after or what? You mean of the girls over here, my models? Yes, yes okay. to your right. Yeah. There is a serum, serum out in, in front, so you do not need to use the serum beforehand. It's for after, right? Yes. And we okay. have that. I take it that's why it's over there. We do, yes. We don't really okay. know what's ready and what's available. But yes, we have that. We also, have, if you go to the website, there's a lot of different, the smooth and the serums, and they're all just very good advanced skincare that helps the treatment, that makes you look good. Like you said, when she, you walked in and she was looking at your face and it looked so amazing. Okay, now that the hair is gone, now you can actually let your skin glow and look fantastic. Correct. Because I, I'm, I'm, I'm a lady that doesn't wear makeup, and she's been trying to teach me. I said, after I'm 60 years old, I'm going to learn how to wear makeup? Are you kidding? No. <laughs> I don't want to ask anything else start in that now. routine. I'm yes, so glad that, that, that you said that about your face and looking good, because we've had a couple of the girls here say the exact same thing. They felt more youthful, and they don't wear a lot of makeup. You know, living down here in the warm weather, they want to be without it. But that this really helped their skin look better. And I don't have to worry about like the ingrown hairs and things like yes. that too because that was the other one like I noticed that I started to get more hairs along this area sort of right along the chin kind of happens around 40 or so <laughs> those extra little hairs that's when they start to get a little bit thicker and a little bit heavier and it's so nice it's so easy to just go right up along that line too it is and, it, and it's really not that hard it it seems like at first it is it's a little mm -hmm. It's a little awkward at first and tea. It's like anything else. Once you learn how to use it, it's right. fine. But it did take me some, you know, a little bit of while. And but I used to pluck my hair on my lip a lot because I didn't want to shave it. I didn't want to get into that. Right. So I would pluck it or I would get it waxed off when I went in to see her every couple of weeks. And this has helped a lot. I do have a mold on my upper lip. Mm -hmm. And I did have a little problem with that. Um, I think I got too reckless or too fast, and it kind of ripped it up a little bit, but it healed. It's fine. It was, I'm sure it was just, I wasn't using it correctly. I don't know, but uh, well, I've got to say it works great. And the upper lip, too, <clears throat> as you're looking here in the before and afters, a good tip and trick for the upper lip, as you saw Kathy doing, is pull it a little pull bit hot, and then you roll it right over, and that's a really easy, a lot of people, the upper lip. Some of the girls close their lips and go up this way. Either yeah. one, whatever's easiest. And like she also said earlier, Kathy, start on the first level when you're doing the, the face and the upper yes. lip. And then when you get used to it, like we saw, and I'm glad that Shirley told us earlier <clears throat> that she was picking up new things, you know, to learn. Because we do, we get it, and we're used to using this. So we're, do, we're just chit-chatting away and no-knowing. So definitely when you start to use it on your face, pull it and, and get it a little bit taut and you'll get used to it. So oh, thank you, Shirley. That's thank you very amazing much, Shirley. amazing testimonial. That was wonderful. And it is just our, if there are little areas that you want to kind of work around. There, the areas for me that were the hardest, right there <laughs> on the knuckles, because my mom always told me I should Wait, never have any hair, hair on, your on my knuckles. Or Kathy's really I'm going to make it all sure out that I don't have <laughs> any hair on my knuckles. I've you know what jewelry shows hair on your knuckles. I know. Well, but that's what now you, you never will. You but also, even on the toes. I know a lot of women talk about that, and on the toes, but and around the knee area. 
That was one of the biggest areas yes. of concern for me because I had never really thought about it. And I was sitting in the car one night and I had crossed my legs and we were sitting in the back seat and my friend who's married to the cute doctor, of course, <laughs> yeah, seriously, he looks over and he goes, oh, how cute. He goes, you're always so together. He goes, look at those cute little hairs on your knee. And I'm like, seriously, really? Note to Did self, you just if you're friends that? with Kathy or your <laughs> Kathy's daughter's <laughs> friends or anyone else, you will get outed on yes, TV. So yes, yes. If you learn to try, I mean, that's the great thing about the show. So they get to try everything. But just know, if you try it, whatever your experience is, it may be shared live. That's right. But we've also, we've been through it, too. What right. I was impressed with was uh, my daughter's friends were all over, and there was like six of them. <clears throat> and they were watching me do this. They're like, well, what is this? And I said, well, yeah. it takes a commitment, because these are teenage girls, right? How committed are they really going to be? And I said, like, it might take you six to eight months. Right. For my legs, it took me about eight months on my legs. My underarms, it was two to three months. I mean, it was just a couple of weeks. My underarms went very, very quickly. So there are different areas take different amounts of time and different commitment. Yes. And one of the girls said, I thought the best, most poignant thing, she goes, but then I'd be done. She goes, I'd commit every single day to that, to not have to worry about it And as, the as parent, I get older. Yeah. And I was like, I love that you just said that. And I said, I go, well, and it's a little bit of an investment. And she goes, but again, but then you're done. I said, yeah, you're done. At the end of time, you don't have to think about it. So I, she and I got talking. I said, well, what do you do? And she goes, well, I actually go in and I have waxing done. And she said, and I had talked to my mom about going and having laser done. Because one girl was a cheerleader and another one was a swimmer. They said it's something that we have to keep our skin smooth sure. all the time. And I got thinking, yeah, if somebody's lifting you up, you don't want to have prickly legs at that time. Oh you God, want to keep that nice thing. and smooth, right? So these are the things that we think about. But also now think about the confidence that you're instilling. These right. girls were fine. They had plenty of confidence. They weren't worried about it. <clears throat> but if you grew up with a mustache, if you had that dark hair on your mm -hmm. upper lip, how did you feel when somebody commented on it? when somebody called it a mustache to you without a lovely British accent. Right. <laughs> so when you have that, you know that feeling. That's not something I ever want my daughter to ever have to go through. Kids go through enough <clears throat> in life. Sure. This is the easiest way for you to remove that unwanted hair. And because there wasn't this technology when we were growing up and things like that, now that there is, there's no reason for you not to allow them to try it because this is safe, it's simple. We'll listen to the doctor one more time so you can feel confident. But the nice thing about No No is, and that's why, when I don't know if we showed our first time user video, if we, can, if we have it, if we can cue that up again. This is one of those things everybody sees it and wants to try. You know when you go through the mall kiosks and they're like, would you like to try this? And you're like, no, I'm on the phone. I'm not going right, to. Yeah. They see yeah. a no-no. People come and flock to it because they've seen this on TV. They've seen it in magazines and your favorite shows. But they still are curious, like, how does this work? The first reaction we always get is everyone's like, is it on? That's it? And that's it. This is all it's doing. So do feel comfortable, parents, that not only are you saving an insane amount of money, obviously, on the the cost of the waxing, but you're also saving their time, their everything else, and it is a very safe and effective way to use it. So if we can take a listen to Dr. Strawn just real quickly, and I think we have another person that we want to talk to, because I do want you to make sure that you know that not only can this work for anyone and everyone as we've stressed, but this is doctor recommended and approved. Take a listen to Dr. Strawn. As a Harvard and Yale educated physician, one of the things that makes me very comfortable talking about no-no is all the research and the clinical trials that show that it really does work. And that's why I feel confident recommending it to my patients. Again, for everyone, no pain, consistency is key. If you're going to buy it and put it away, don't buy it. Seriously, it would be a waste of your money if you're not going to use it. And the more you use it, the faster your results. So why not? I mean, if you were going to do it like I was, I was doing it every other, or I was doing it twice a week. So it's like every three to four days is when I was doing it. And I said to Jen, I'm like, yeah, I'm still going on my legs and I'm still going. I'm still going. She, I said, well, how often do you do it? Because she was already done. And she said, I do it every single day. She goes, why not? If you're already doing something every day. So then I started doing it at least it was I tried to go every day. If it wasn't every day, it was every other day, which I think will be plenty for most of you. You will get incredible results. Let's welcome in Patricia, who's calling us. The gold just sold out as and well. I was getting you a silver leopard. Patricia. Oh, sorry. Hi. Patricia, Patricia, you just ordered the gold. You were smart. You got in on it early. What do you love about the no-no? Have you ever used no-no before? Yes, I have. I have the uh, turquoise color one. I've had it, I think, about a year and a half. And, uh, you know, it's just, it's really, really easy to use. Uh, 
the, the smell of it at first was a little odd because, you know, it's, I mean, it's heat and it's hair and it burns and it, but it's okay. You know, you think, whoa, what is that? But you buff it off. It's, it's very smooth feeling. Uh, it's really easy to do. And I've been to Scotland and Ireland with it and it's so easy to take care of everything there and not have to worry about cutting yourself and bleeding everywhere. Well, that has, it's traveled internationally with you. I love it. Yes, it has. And it will go when I go back to Scotland next year too, I'm sure. But, uh, yeah, I wasn't sure. I I think I have used it under my arms one time. Uh, you know, I'm not. I'm. Do, do I need to be kind of dry when I do that? Because I wonder if if I'm doing it right. You know, we're down under our arms. arms. Yeah, the underarms, like Kathy said when she said you got to flatten, I do recommend too. It's kind of hard because it's a curved area. Get the small, use the small tip. Okay. Definitely put it on the highest, and you almost want to flatten that area. I know it's hard. I'm not gonna sit here and do my underarms for you, but flatten it that area, <laughs> and then go ahead and go under. It's hard. You know, you're typically used to. Or sometimes I put it up flat behind my back, as if That's I'm it. doing like the at the gym, those kind of tricep. You do that yeah. and then you can hold it and then you can get under there because it's a little bit easier. You're not trying to get that concave area and make sure you have the small tip in as well. Right. And the underarm should I, be I like easy. grab the other side of my face. She was, she has I all even kinds of crazy face, ways to do this. I do that and She's getting that's yoga done it. while she's doing it. Right, exactly, right. multitasking yes. at its finest. Yeah, yeah like that, you sit there and you put it that over way, your head. That way, so if I did that and kind of just, you can even just use it sort of hold on the other side of your neck. And that gets that skin nice and right. taught. That way you don't have to just sit here and Thank show your you. underarm. <laughs> I, show I mean, I know there's no hair there, but I figure I'll just spare you. Right. <laughs> but I'm glad too, Patricia, that you're buying your, your second one. You're, every caller we've had today, this is their second one. So that's... That's a good thing, and I, I definitely recommend, you know, if you're using this and this is your second one that you're getting and your third one you're passing on, hold on to this one. I mean, everyone keeps get, giving them away and, right. and letting everybody use it. These are the exclusive ones, the exclusive leopard print colors and everything. So thank you, and thank you for sharing gonna, your story with us. I'm probably going to give my, my older one to uh, my niece who...